Welcome to the ETA Business Forum. This is the meeting point for those who mean business when they talk about fusion technology and aspire to be part of ETA, the biggest international collaboration in the field of energy. We will be speaking to senior policymakers, representatives of industry and SMEs and fusion associations, together with industrial liaison officers, in order to hear their views about ITER and see what opportunities and prospects they see behind the greatest experiment in energy. We are creating something that is absolutely unique. It's hugely challenging and it hasn't been done before. This of course means that we are going to be pressing technology to the limit of what we know today. In fact, we're going to be inventing new technologies and much of this invention will take place in the industry, but in a partnership with other high-tech technology carriers such as companies, but also as public research organizations. So our expectation is that the small and medium uh, size enterprises, which are where much of the uh, innovation takes place in society, that they will, on the one hand, help us address this very challenging, very difficult task of uh, making uh, fusion a reality, but it will frankly also be part of improving the competitiveness of our economy, making sure that there's job creation and that in current uh, markets, in near-term markets. Potential for um, companies, European companies, in the ITER project is vast, as fusion is now becoming a growing industry with a lot of market opportunities. So companies and European companies can learn from each other, can learn from technical expertise and scientific expertise with other countries, and use this knowledge to grow their own organisation, and also use it for this project and for future projects. The potential of projects like the ITER uh, is tremendous for European industry. Um, it provides for industry new business opportunities. Many companies are, are concentrating on their core market and ITER is a, a new business opportunity for them. ITER is a challenging uh, opportunity for industry. Most of it is conventional engineering, but 20 or 30 percent will be challenging engineering. And industry needs to build up the expertise so that it can help us to build future fusion reactors uh, following ITER. ITER represents business opportunities. Today and since 2008, there have been more than 2.7 billion euros of contracts awarded. Uh, in addition, of course, for European companies, ITER represents an opportunity to demonstrate that their technical skills and their capacity to work for a very demanding project in a nuclear environment. For me, uh, the most important point is um, the possibility to develop uh, over the long term partnerships at a European and international level. A project like ITA will certainly improve the capability of industry in terms of uh, engineering and uh, fabrication. Furthermore, uh, working in an international environment would open the minds of the people which are involved and this is a very good asset after having done this. Last but not least, working for ITER, this is an experience from the past, will create spin-offs which uh, the industry is able to use for other business. It's not just any other business opportunity, it's first of all a major project with a major investment in European industry. It's also uh, there's both conventional deliveries but there's also very high-tech, very specialized uh, technologies required. Technologies that are on the brink of what's possible today. The first uh, major challenge for SMEs and industry in general to get involved in a project like ITER is that they should be able to see themselves and their competences being relevant to ITER. They may hear about ITER and think, well, it's a fusion energy research project. We don't know anything about fusion energy. We, we are not scientists, so how can we con contribute? But ITER consists of 10 million parts, many of those being conventional. It's not only an issue for big players in the field, but that also on the second tier level, uh, contracting, there are possibilities. Um, we have many 
uh, technical uh, companies which have niche competences and which have to find their place in, in the whole play. So in that sense, a project like ITER is really a great opportunity uh, to create a European-wide networking of uh, technological companies. Once joining the ITER project, industry is another important uh, member of this project and develop necessary technologies which is not existing right now. I believe uh, industry will uh, uh, concentrate uh, their human resources to eat a project. Therefore, industry can train uh, these people, especially I hope young people, and their skill and the career path developed. This is another, not visible, but the benefit.